James Lee Jackson walked into court to update Judge Linda Collum on his behavior to a conditional release agreement for the 2014 attack on his brother. Jackson wanted to bring him in to ensure he was complying. Obviously, he wasn't. So. But Jackson's public defender decided to waive the hearing until his arraignment on another stabbing. That case involves Jordan White, who was stabbed in the back on Sunday, May 20th, outside a bar in Five Points. Jackson was arrested for stabbing his brother in 2014. He pleaded not guilty due to insanity and was given a conditional release this year. Five months later, police say Jackson stabbed Jordan White in the back. White recalled the attack from his bedside. I started... I it was panicking and I screamed at him and asked why, like why and what I do to you. This is the conditional release and based upon his most recent arrest, he has violated it. The release required Jackson to meet 17 conditions, including follow his treatment plan, not leave Florida without permission from a judge, not own, possess, or have access to firearms or any other illegal weapons. Since Jackson's arrest this month, he has violated the conditional release. It's unknown whether Jackson will be sent to a mental health facility or to jail. Jackson will be back in court on June 19th to talk about that stabbing incident he's accused of and also to finally talk about the violation of the conditional release. Janice Harris, Channel 4, the local station.